guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name's Ashley. And today I have my huge monthly Sam's Club haul. You guys, we are running so low on everything. I feel like I start off every Sam's Club haul saying that, but honestly, we are so low on just like lunches for the kids, snacks for school, dinner ideas, which if you guys have been following me for a while, really, he just threw a diaper. <laughs> um, if you've been following me for a while, then you know that I typically do my like meal planning grocery shopping for HEB or like a smaller grocery store and then my bulk items I get from Sam's Club like toiletries and snacks and stuff like that where we need more of it but for like my produce and stuff for the most part I get that at the grocery store that way I don't have so much where it goes bad so today we need snacks all of that good stuff some random items I did take a picture of my list I have it on my phone because I did not want to forget it because there's a lot of like random things and I feel like whenever I have those like random little things those are the things I'll forget <laughs> so I have a picture of my list on my phone and we are ready to get going I actually had to take Aubrey to a doctor's appointment this morning. She had to get her 12 year old shots since she just turned 12. So we went and took her to do that. I dropped her off at school and now we are finally ready to go. So I'm gonna take you guys shopping with me at Sam's Club and then I will get home and show you guys everything that I picked up. You ready to go to Sam's Club, buddy? Yeah. Got mommy's card? You got it? Yeah. Awesome. Here we go. Your big helper. Oh, I love when they have the perfumes. So cheap. Ooh, I think this is the one that I like. They didn't have it the last time. Or no, is it this one? I don't know. I love the juicy couture. We have those containers. Do we have those? These are really nice containers with the flip lock top. Yeah, it holds noodles. Oh, Ziploc bags. I just recently got some, but that's a good deal. 152 bags. Whoa, scented chalk. <laughs> Halloween Oreos. All you Starbucks lovers, they get the pumpkin spice Starbucks coffee. Watermelon! <gasps> watermelon. What's my watermelon do? You got me stranded. Oh, I want one of those wagons. That'd be nice for like soccer practice and stuff. Here's the area I'm excited for, the oh, fall stuff. Oh, look at the wreath. That is so pretty. Oh, that big lantern, oh my goodness, it's super cute. Not sure how much it costs, I can't see up there. Oh, that is super cute, inflatable haunted house. Oh, they're so cute, do you like it, buddy? Yeah. Yeah. Look over here. It's a twinkling arch. Oh, there we go. Oh, look at the creepy scarecrow. Look, it's eight foot tall. Ah, look. That is too cool. Won't you pick me up? Look how cute! They have a pumpkin pillow! Aww. Fall, sweet fall. Those are cute! That's a really cool Halloween. Instead of passing out candy, they have scented Play Doh. Okay, these are really cool. Do you like those? These plants are so cute. 
says it's a money tree braid. Oh, those are cute. Victory. I have not seen this Ninja Creamy. It's kind of cool. What, baby? Freeze. Ooh, make ice cream and stuff. Oh, these are too cute. You ready to go night night? Okay, honey. As soon as we go home, you can go night night, okay? You tired? Yeah. Okay. Oh, this Bissell Swivel Pet. Is that a vacuum? Yeah, vacuums on sale for a hundred dollars. That's a good deal. Huh. I really need more plastic cups, especially now that the kids are getting bigger. And these are on sale for only 12 bucks. Bless you. And it does come with 12. And they're pretty. Ooh, I might get them. A trunk organizer. That is really cool. Need that for Sam's Club. <laughs> Woke up from a dream without a sun. The world was upside. Are you come over here say cheese stuff but hopefully it'll last us close to a month a lot of the items are things that should last us a while so I'm excited we're nice and stocked up again I'm gonna get home show you guys what I got I was like this close to buying the Dyson the cordless vacuum I have been wanting one for a while and I was texting my husband and he was like just get it but I don't know everything is so expensive right now it just has me a little hesitant on buying like big purchases like that but I don't know we'll see maybe it'll go on sale soon right now it wasn't like I don't think it was on sale I kind of want to do some online research and check prices but anyway we're gonna go ahead head home and I will show you guys what I picked up here is everything I picked up from Sam's going to start over here of course I picked up the kids some bread for all their sandwiches for school I went ahead and got this big box of pinto beans. It comes with six cans. I use a lot of beans in my recipe and I feel like beans are so interchangeable. So they had pinto beans. So I went ahead and got those. This is a new Lucky Charms. We haven't had this one before yet. I thought it was cute with the Magic Gems marshmallows. So I went ahead and got that. And this is usually a top pick for the kids. This and Fruity Pebbles. So I went ahead and got that. I needed some more noodles. I really don't use like elbow and panini too often, but they didn't have just the spaghetti noodles like they typically do. So I went ahead and just got this. It comes with six boxes. This is gonna last us a really long time. And then I went ahead and got 12 cans of diced tomatoes. It's such a better price to get it in bulk. And I use a lot of diced tomatoes, so that will definitely get used up. I also got three things of the Classico tomato and basil sauce. And then Ethan wanted some go -Gurts, so I went ahead and got some go for the kids. I went ahead and got a thing of Greek yogurt. I wanted to get my individual Greek yogurts that I typically get, but they didn't have any. So I went ahead and just got this big thing of plain Greek yogurt. 
The main thing I wanted to use this for is for my smoothies in the morning to add more protein but not have it like too overpowering like the protein powder taste. I'm gonna add some Greek yogurt, so I went ahead and got that. Ethan also wanted some grapes. They were a pretty good price. They were like five something for this big, I think this is like four pounds, no, three pounds. So not too bad of a price. So I got a thing of grapes. Needed some more bacon. Also got some cheese sticks for the kids. This is great for taking to school. I'm trying to get a little bit healthier snacks for the kids because we have been eating not so healthy recently. So got some cheese sticks. Me and my husband are buckling down as well, and he wanted Brussels sprouts. I am not the biggest fan of Brussels sprouts. I ate them when we went out to dinner for our anniversary, and they were really good. They were like almost like crispy and kind of burnt tasting, so I figure I'm gonna look up some recipes, maybe cook them in the air fryer, and hopefully I will like them, but my husband likes them, so either way, they'll get eaten. <laughs> and then he also wanted asparagus, so I got some of that. We needed some more ground beef, so I got three pounds of the organic grass-fed 85% lean. These were on sale for, I believe it was $2.50 off of the box. So I went ahead and got two because my kids love these. They are super quick and easy for breakfast, especially with school now. So got those. They finally had the chicken breast tenderloins. But oh my gosh, you guys, prices are going up. It was $21 for this bag, and I believe it's a six pound bag. I almost got two, but oh, it's just so expensive. So I just got one, and I figured I got ground beef and some other meat, so it should hold us over for a few weeks. The kids love these Belveda um, little cracker cookie things. This is the blueberry flavor. This is their favorite. Thought this is a good like, whole grain snack for them. Also got these little mandarin oranges. Everyone loves these, they are so good. And this time we went with the chicken nuggets shaped like dinosaurs, it's a limited time. And it was a better price. This is a four pound bag. And I wanna say it was like $2 cheaper than the ones that I typically get, so got those and then of course I got some pizza for a quick and easy dinner got some gala apples and a big five pound bag that's good for them to pack for school lunches as well I also got some shrimp some of the kids will eat shrimp but I mainly got it for me and my husband because I think Aubrey's really the only one who likes shrimp and then I got this huge bag of carrots figured I could use this for tons of soups or just to bake them in the oven they're really good like that too I needed some onions. I got a really big bag of onions. Also these little potatoes. Love these in the air fryer and inside soups and stuff. These are very versatile, so got a big bag of that. Austin has been begging for Nutella. We have not had Nutella in the house in probably a month or two. So went ahead and got some Nutella for the school lunches. Also got some of these little cherry tomatoes. I love sauteing these with a little bit of butter. And if you do it with some like zucchini and squash, oh, it's so good, little onions in there. So I think I'm gonna make that sometime this week. Sam's Club didn't have any zucchini or squash, so I'll have to pick that up at the grocery store, but I'm excited to cook that. The kids ran out of their vitamins, so I got them some more of their little critters gummy vitamins. These are the ones we typically get. And it comes with 300, so I like it because it lasts us a while. With four kids taking them, we go through vitamins pretty quick in this house. I did not want to buy these, but Ethan was begging, so I gave in. Got some cherry and blueberry Pop-Tarts. We aren't quite out of cheese yet, so I didn't want to get a huge five pound bag again. So I went ahead and got this two pounds. It comes with um, individuals, individual one pound bags and I figured I can freeze them and pull them out whenever I need them. And I wanna say it was like $7 for two, so not too bad of a price. I went ahead and got this Odo Ban. It is about to be six season, especially with the kids back in school. So I love adding this into the laundry and I thought it was really cool. It comes with a spray bottle so I can actually spray it on. It says fabric and in the air to kill germs. So love that. I'm gonna be using that a lot, especially with fall right around the corner. We also ran out of syrup, so I got some more maple syrup. Got some of these Oreo cookies. 
I just thought they were cute for, you know, Halloween coming up. I also got a big thing of applesauce. It comes with 36 of them, so that'll be good for school lunches too. And then this was such a good deal that I couldn't pass it up. It was like 11 something, and these glasses were super cute. I took forever to decide on the color. I just went ahead and went with clear. I almost got the like gray colored ones. I thought they were pretty, but got these because the kids are getting older and they need more plastic cups. All I have are like those super mini ones, you know, at Walmart, you get like the set of plates and cups and spoons and stuff, but they're super tiny. So this will be better for them. They're bigger. All I really have are like big glass cups and yeah, we're not doing that. So I got those and then I picked up some more tortillas. We're not quite out yet, but I'm going to throw this in the freezer for whenever we run out. I also needed some more Parmesan cheese. I've been making a lot of recipes using this recently. So I went ahead and got this huge 24 ounce thing of it. It should hopefully last us a while. Also got some Go Go Squeeze yogurts. The little kids love these. Aubrey doesn't really like them, but that's a good snack for the kids to pack for school. I also needed some more trash bags. I had to buy some from, I think I bought some from Target the other day. I was completely out, but I went ahead and got my big thing of it because we go through a lot of trash bags. And then the main thing we needed, toilet paper. We are legit completely out of toilet paper. So I got toilet paper. I got Ethan some more diapers. He's in a size seven. Like I told you guys, he's doing so good potty training, but I still like to use diapers because they're just quick and easy to take on and off and they're cheaper instead of pull-ups. So went ahead and got some diapers and then I got a case of water for my husband. So that is everything. Oh no. And I also got two bags of salt for the water softener. And the grand total today was $477. So I must admit, putting away the groceries is like the number one thing I dread doing because it feels like such a tedious task. It takes me forever to put away everything, especially when I do these really big Sam's Club hauls. So most of the time, if I'm honest, I just pick up the cold stuff and then I will go take a break, go do something, eat a snack, and then come back and pick up the rest. Let me know down in the comments. Do you guys do the same thing? Because I don't know, putting away groceries is so time consuming.
right, you guys, I'm gonna go ahead and close out the vlog. I gotta quickly finish putting away everything. My sprinkler repair guy is on his way. So I'm gonna try to hustle, get this done. But I hope you guys enjoyed shopping with me and seeing my huge Sam's Club haul as a family of six. If you did, don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. It really does help support my channel. And if you're new here, I would love for you to subscribe, join my YouTube family. I upload tons of videos just like this one. Sam Club hauls, shop with me's, tons of videos like that, plus stay in the life vlogs basically anything to do with being a stay-at-home mom. So if you enjoy content like that, I would love for you to subscribe and join my YouTube family. I do upload every single Monday and Friday, so I would love to have you here. But I hope you guys have a wonderful day, and I can't wait to see you in the next one. Bye!